guys, welcome back to my channel. I'm gonna do my summertime foundation routine for a base that lasts all day long. So I'm gonna prime with my No Problem by Touch and Soul. I'm doing very tiny dots. I'm just taking whatever excess and rubbing it in the rest of my face, but mainly hitting the spots where I want you know, could be super primed. For foundation, what I have found on me that works the best is the Too Faced Peach Perfect Comfort Matte Foundation. I'm not super dry, so it worked for me really well, but it's also not a very drying. It is true to what it says where it's a comfort matte. Like, it's not feeling like it sucks all the moisture out of your face. I had to lighten my shade a little bit because it the one I have is too dark. I'm gonna buff that in with a brush and then I'll go over it with my sponge. It smells so good too, guys. So it's not 100% full coverage, but it does cover a lot of my um, acne scars to enough to where I don't feel like super self-conscious about them. Add the last of what's on my palette. And press it all into the skin. And bring it up down the neck a little bit. Go in with some concealer. I'm mixing Tarte Shape Tape and the Milani Conceal and Perfect. So I like to do the shape tape first and prime my lids with it. And then I take the Milani, because it's all, it's, uh, it seems quite a bit lighter, but I go right here where the hollows and indentations of my eye sockets are and where my dark circles are. They're very dark. And I give it a second to set in before I go and blend it out just to help. I do spread it out, but my main goal is to keep it focused right here. Like, I'm going to try not to go all the way to my outer eye. Just keep it right here in the front. But also while trying to keep it completely blended perfectly. So I'm going to set my eyes with the Too Faced Ethereal Powder. Born This Way Ethereal. Powder. It is one of my absolute favorites. I think it's actually one of the best powders. Now to set my face, I take the Too Faced Peach Perfect Mattifying Powder. So it's not because like super love Too Faced. I do love them, but it's ultimately this is what works. Right? I found it works. I'm going to take the powder and I'm going to put a lot I mean, chin kind of sort of bake, like a, a small one. About my nose, my chin, and my smile lines. My nose, or my chin is where I usually lose all my foundation. By the end of the day, it's gone. But I found with this combo, and by doing this, it stays. It doesn't help, or it's not that. It also helps that it tastes good. <laughs> so when it's flying around, at least it's not terrible. I just don't set my under eyes with it because it is mattifying and like my under eyes are a little bit dry as it is. 
So I don't want to overly do it. So then I'll take, this is a three step process for setting sprays, but I take the first step of this and it is the Tatcha Luminous Dewy Skin Mist. So like you could probably use any type of dewy setting spray. Um, I do this to bring some more life back into the face to make it seem more natural instead of matte. Like this literally isn't to set the face and that's the key here is this is literally just to bring some more luminosity back to the face. All right, so I'm gonna do the rest of my face and I'll be right back. And now that that's done, I will set my face with Urban Decay All Nighter. I'm gonna do my eyes and then I'll be right back again. Okay, so for the last and final step, and you're gonna like, Katie, this is oat for kill. I reset my whole face with Max Six Plus. And I mean like I drench my face. And honestly, I think the three of those setting sprays plus the foundation and powder literally just do everything that I need it to and more. Using three setting sprays is totally overkill. But I don't necessarily think that it's the three different setting sprays. I honestly think it's just setting my face three times that gives me the longevity that I look for. So that's how I get my face. And like literally it's 1040 right now. And by the time I take this off at probably 930 to 1130. So 11 to 13 hours from now, my face will look just a little bit worse than this, but it will still look really good. That's it. That's how I get my base. If you like this video, please give it a big thumbs up. If you haven't subscribed, please subscribe to my channel and I will see you in my next one.